The show is brought to you by such patrons as Electro Pirate, Big Boy Farts 666, Jesus Penis, Despicable Dogs, Benjamin, Dharma Wheelies, It's Leon Motherfucker, Parkman, Phone Losers of America, Fancy Pants, MST3 Clay, Anonymous, Gordo, Crispy808, and Mr. Turbois. Thank you to everyone for supporting the show. You can find out more at immoralhole.com. You can find our archives at travelswithmiriam.com. You can listen to our live shows at 10 p.m. Eastern on Fridays on immoraljuice.com. You can find our Patreon at patreon.com forward slash madhousemilitia. If you wish to contribute to us via PayPal, Cash App, Crypto, or Ko-fi, you can find the links at immoralhole.com forward slash show forward slash contribute. Hello? Hello? Wait a minute. Uh, oh. Wait a minute. Okay, I'm holding. I'm holding. It's all right. Oh. Uh, Hello? Wait one second, sir, please. Uh, Hold right. on one I'm second. Holding. I'm holding on. Wait, let me talk. Let me see this. Oh, cuz. Excuse me? I'm right here. All right, you got the trailer, and it's Roberta there. Okay, go ahead now. All right, is Roberta there? I got a pretty song to play for her. What, the trailer? Yeah, the trailer and Roberta. <sighs> I was asking nine hundred dollars for the trailer. All right. Where's Roberta? She comes with it. Well, I guess so. If you want. Her. All right. Let me play a nice little song. Oh, your your fire alarm. You got to replace the battery in that. My fire alarm. What's wrong with my fire alarm? Well, you heard a beep. That means the battery's running low. You got to replace the battery, or it won't work. I, I was beeping. I was pushing the buttons on it. Anyways, I thank you for calling. You have a good night. Well, no, I got a song for Roberta here. It starts like this. Hello. Hey, yeah, uh, you just had a yard sale. Did what? You just had a yard Have sale. A little- we're having one tomorrow. Well, I just want to know what kind of shit you have that I could come get because I can't make it tomorrow. <laughs> well, you ain't getting nothing tonight. Well, I'll be nice. Hello? I know you're there. Don't you goddamn hang up on me. Hello? Put your pants on and answer the phone. Ah, Milkman, your your thing is hella loud. That shit went in my ear. Volume down. He's fine for me, he might just need to have Damn it, fucking milk. What is your hello. name, baby? Hey, hello. How you doing? Hey, oh, hello, hi. How you That's doing there, baby? Shit. How are you? You hear me, baby? What you need? Fuck is your problem? What? Ah, I don't want to talk problem. to you. I want to talk. Ah, you're a piece of shit. Shut up. Tell me your problem. Fuck me. Hello, asshole. There it is, nut. Hello, motherfucker. Milk, milkman farted and milk came out. Uh, call, call this guy back. Let me straighten things out. Still, but milk, still they're still there. Get your favorite flavor at your ma'am, favorite hey, outlet ma'am, of immoraljuices.com. Ma'am, ma'am, can you pick up the damn phone, please? I'm going to have Milkman fart on the yeah. phone. And then Drop the attitude and pick up the phone. The Valvatine? Look, we don't want to watch QVC with you. Please pick up the phone. 
Nobody wants to watch MASH. That CPT sucks. Thank you for calling Adidas. This is Michelle. How can I help you? Yeah, I parked across the street. You know the little parking lot across from Bloomingdale's? You know how there's a little parking structure right there? I'm actually not on site, so I'm not really familiar with the parking structure, but um, I can... Well, there's uh, a parking lot right there. I always park there, and then it goes into Bloomingdale's, and I walk up to Bloomingdale's, and I go out and up, and your store is right there. You know how your store, the bottom floor, had a door that goes outside to Market Street? When are you guys going to open that? I'm I'm not sure. I mean, is it usually... usually not closed or it's closed today no it's not open it's not open the bottom the bottom door the one that connects out to the to market street is always locked why okay that's uh, i'm not sure why i, I it's not can i talk to somebody who knows i have an answer to i can try um that's i mean unfortunately i don't have an answer to that question let me see what can i can I find out for you who knows can i talk to somebody who knows okay I, that's bullshit. I, Every I time I park on Bloomingdale's okay, and still walking just, around, I have to deal with a bum taking a shit on the street. If you guys had that door open down there, I could just go in through there and I wouldn't have to deal with all these people taking a piss everywhere. Okay, I totally understand where you're coming from. Let me see if I can find out um, some further information on that door. Um, did you a guy came up to me. He said his name was Milkman. He said his name was Milkman, and he... And he had his willy out. He was walking around next to Bloomingdale's. He's like, I'm Milkman. I'm Milkman. Yeah, yeah. And he had a little guitar. Okay. Right, that would be like, uh, more like an issue for secu- the, like, the security team. Um, That's somebody that knows have, what like, they're talking about that. on the phone. Okay. Okay. Dollar, that would be an issue for security, so you would have to locate security within the There's building. Somebody that knows what they're talking about on the phone, damn it. issue. Okay, that, the, somebody walking around like that is mm-hmm. more a security issue. It's not an Adidas issue, sir. You would have to locate I the don't security. Care. The I don't care. I don't care. I want to talk to someone, a manager. I don't care. Give me a and why are you charging what? full okay, price for point threes when you don't have any point ones? God damn it! Is it just because it's San Francisco? You guys overprice shit. Okay, uh, that's that's the price that the store has for that those items. It's not. How come? It's how, not come for, how come? When I go to the back of the one, how come when I go to the back of the one, everything is fifty percent off? But your guys' store is also an outlet store. It's full price. That the price of stores differ. It's, it's not specific for any store location. The pricing varies per store. That's bullshit. Let me here talk to my grandpa. His name is Dwight. Hey there. Hey, this is Dwight. We just don't understand why the door is always closed. My princess. Hello. Hello? With that tranny <laughs> with the bangs on. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Chorizo. Can I have some chorizo? Put that tranny with the bangs on. Do you guys have chorizo? Motel. I went to the dude drop in oh. before. Huh? Hello. Hello? Yes. What what is what is your name? This is what's King your, Motel. What's your name? In? This no, is what's King your Motel. name? In? I'm the manager. Uh, oh, hi King. How are you? I'm good. I hope you reign for many many years as the king of the motel, my liege. Thank How you. May How may I serve you? How can I serve you? How can I serve you, my liege? I am your humble servant. <laughs> Bye. Being repressed. Buenas uh, noches, uh, me... bueno. Hola, you guys have chorizo? Ah, motel Beno. No, chorizo. No. 
¿Yo, ¿No tiene chorizo para breakfast? Que esto es un motel Venus. Venus, culo relleno. No. <laughs> Hello, Tinto Country Charlie. How can I help you? Hi, Mushi Mushi. We're gonna come over there, five of us. Sorry? Hello. Um, Mushi Mushi. We're gonna come over there, five of us. Five people. Hello. Sorry, I cannot. Hi. Huh? Wheel, wheel, wheel. Hello? How do no. you say? What? What do you say? Sir, I cannot thank you. Sorry. Hi. Mushi, mushi. Me, my boyfriend, my girlfriend, my dad, my mom, and mm -hmm. and one more people. Somebody. Oh, I know it wasn't him speaking. <laughs> one Hello. Was, he, Hi. Hello. 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 Yes. How are you? Good. Hi. What what what's your name is? What do you need? How may I help you? Oh, I need a room. Yes, but you have to be here to get yes. the room. Yeah, the first come first service. No, because I, I, I have for the elderly, please. Thank yeah, you. my grandpa, my grandpa. We need to know that there's going to be a room when we get there, because my grandpa. Yes, please, I'm very So, yeah, uh, we have a room available. But what if we get there and it's not available anymore? I'm sorry? It's, oh, no, Grandpa just... Oh, oh no. Oh. oh, Sorry, I, I had a lot of refried three, four whole days. <laughs> There's oh, two birds. There's a hummingbird. There we go. There's two birds. If you compare my dick to a bird, mine's a black hawk. Gordos is a hummingbird. Mira, chocha. Hello. Hello. Hello, yeah. I, I can't hear you. You know, say nothing when you answer the phone, man. Well, you were talking. I didn't want to interrupt you. You were saying some random stuff to your other people. Well, here, you know what? I'm kind of mad. I'm kind of mad. Talk to my wife, Penty. God damn it. Okay. So, how am I help you? Hello. Hello? Hey, uh, what's your purpose? Purpose in terms of? Like, in general, what is your purpose? To be alive. Excellent. All right. Mm. What do you do with the gift of life, man? You don't do nothing? Come on. You, got, you don't serve no purpose or what? I just live my day day by day. Day by day, you don't prepare for the future. You don't have a past. Come on, man. We're trying to talk to you, man. Oh, well, this is your, will talk. Is your purpose... Um, do you need to help with the room or something, or... Cause... Yeah, talk to my brother. Talk to my brother. He's here, too. Fucker. Yeah, what is what is your purpose when it comes to the... F day by day, he doesn't worry about tomorrow. Hello? Hello? Hi, I need some more shoe grease in know? here. Like, I walked in the room, and there's no green. Come on, man. I'm just gonna call a bunch of numbers and see if anybody Hello? Hello? Hi! Hello? <laughs> Hello? Hello? Oh. Hello? Can you hear Hi, me? Hi, ma'am. Uh, It's your grandson. What? My balls are going to explode, Hi, man. It's, it's your grandson. Wow. Hi, yeah. Faith. How are you? How are you doing? Good. Fuck me. Doing very well. How are you doing? Oh, pretty huh? good. I just shoot. Yeah, I'm just practicing my shooting. I got some propane tanks in the backyard, and I'm shooting at them. You are. What are you up? Yeah. They're not full mm -hmm. or anything. They're only half full. Yeah. Maybe hey, they'll be you got a soup beans, Granny. Well, you got a soup beans, Granny. Oh, this is my shooting instructor. He's here too. I will you? I'm hungry. And, and I, yeah, I'm, I'm his I'm boyfriend. Hungry. And it's um, 
Yeah, he's also, his boyfriend is here. He's making us some chorizo. I got a big chorizo I put with two eggs. I put it on the plate. He's got what? Yeah. He says, um, when he cooks the chorizo, he says, um, let's get this out onto a tray. Nice. Yeah. Um, I was, eggs with heat. I was wondering if you can call me Papi for the rest of the call, please. My name is Papi. This is not safe. Yeah, it is. I told you I was in the backyard shooting a propane tank. We had we we well, did that whole thing with the start. Well, why did you call, Seth? Well, I'm out of bullets, and I was wondering if you had any spares. I'm just a chat GPT bot. No, I don't have any spare bullets. You got potatoes? Because um, I got a potato gun I could use. Maybe some sugar or some rice. We can do like the bag of rice and put it in a in a pillowcase and I can hit Milkman over the fucking head with it. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. That's, that's a good idea, actually. Like these you had some hit Milkman. <laughs> This is not hey, fair. It is, Seth. Look, I was thinking I've got a musket. And if you've got some Aye. rice, I, I could pack the musket with rice and shoot rice at the propane tanks. That could work. I don't have any Grandma? rice. You got pasta? You remember when we yeah. used to make macaroni art? Remember when we used to glue the macaroni to the construction paper? You told me I was really artistic, and I and I misunderstood you. I thought you said I was really autistic, and I got offended. Hey, hey, says you better tell her that Jesus came back, and he's on NBC right now. He's he's on the news. He's signing autographs. He's signing the Bible. Jesus is shining the Bible. Why is Jesus the only one that gets a book deal? Hey, listen, I've got um, to go to sleep. Okay, Grandma. Make sure. Ah, uh, you have reached by Pleasant. So I missed your call, but please leave you a name and number, and I'll call you back. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye-bye. Welcome At the tone, back. please record your message. When you've finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. To leave a callback number, press 5. Hi there. Could you give me a call back? I'm calling about the snapper. I want to get some fresh snapper here. All right. Thank you, dear. Give me a call back. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for calling the world famous little darlings, Oklahoma City. It's V. How can I help you? Okay. Where is this? Hello? Jesus, gentlemen. Hi. Have you got girls there? Uh, yes, we do have girls here. All right. Now, do they take charcoal or gas? Do we, we don't have grills, no. There's no girls, girls there? Yes, we have girls, not grills. Right. But they they cook on the grill? No. I thought this was a barbecue place. No, it is a gentleman's club. Right. Sounds right to me. Need some breasts, some thighs, a couple wings. if If it's a gentleman's club, why is this fucking jerk there? Excuse me. Yeah, it says it's a it's a gentleman's club. Why are you in there? You're a, you're a fucking asshole. No, I am not an asshole. Uh huh. That's what the girls tell me every time they're grinding on my hairy dick. They're like, "Hey, the guy's an asshole. Watch out for him." Station. Hey. Hi. Hi. Thank you for calling. How can I help? I, uh, I, the woman, do you know the woman is in there? She dances, she shakes her boobies for dollars? Uh, yes. Are you on your way? 
No, that's my mom. I need to talk to her. Okay, one second. Okay. Mays County Police Department. Hi, I want I want to make a report. There was a woman who shaked her boobies to pour some sugar on me, and I I remained flaccid. All right. Well, uh, this is Officer John Marshall, and I'm posted here wanting to know why you keep calling this club. You're posted there doing what? What What is your purpose at the gentleman's club? Uh, security. Okay, security. We of have one. your we have your what caller you ID on log. Would you like I don't, us to? I don't give a shit. I don't give a shit. Shut up. Please, yeah, fuck you the know, police. You, yes, <laughs> dick sucker. Yeah, fuck the police is what I say to you. Well, yeah, I agree. It's a felony uh, to pretend to be a police officer. Sir. Yeah, it's also a felony to pretend to be a man too. Uh, <laughs> you don't like four pretend. felonies or anything. Pretending. You don't even have balls, so. Hey, what color is your? Yeah. What a big old man. Fuck hey, you, Nutella. Is this the tranny with the bangs? Hello? It's one. And? You must have a number. No, are you are you the one that runs the arcade in town? No, this is JGA Corp. We just say we we don't have arcades. Wait, what did you say you do? Can you repeat that? Well, I'm going to help you. Under purpose. Hey, can I talk you to are? the uh, whore coach that you have in there? The what? The whore coach. I don't know who that is. Uh, Jennifer? I need my state name. Oh, oh, um, uh, Candy. We have a candy tonight? We ain't got no candy tonight, do we? Give me a minute. All right. What's your idea, then? Hello? Hey, hi. Nope, no candy tonight. She might come in later. Oh. Right, no. Okay. All right. but Her name is Crystal. Her name is Crystal. We don't have that one either. Wow. Brandy. All right, try later. Okay. No. Hurry up, Office, hurry up. Office can help Hello? you. Hello? Is this the office in the club? Hello? It is, yes. Hey, um, I was there and was getting felt up by one of the ladies there, and I think she stole my wallet. Oh, yeah? Uh, yeah. Which one was it? The one with the breast and the buttocks, that lady? Oh, yeah. Uh, well, that, that narrows it down. <laughs> I think it would. Yeah. Uh, well, we haven't seen but any it, wallets, so. Well, it's not like she would bring it to the lost and found there, buddy, you know? That's true. She told well, me. without having an actual me that, description, it's hard for me to determine who, you know, that would be. Because we have several. She had red hair. Red hair. Yeah. We don't have anybody here that has red hair, though. Well, I'm colorblind, so that doesn't help. Ah. Uh, okay. Hey, though, here's the thing. Here's the thing, though. She told me I was good looking, and I knew that she was, you know, trying to butter yeah. me out. Hey, Shannon. Shannon. For you. For you. Um, guy asked for you. Huh? Hey, Shannon. Yeah. You know, you were feeling me up and you stole my wallet. You kind of want it back. Yeah, Janet? I'm pretty sure I didn't steal your wallet. You didn't? No. Maybe it just fell out. Maybe it just fell out when you were bumping and grinding. Maybe. Could be. Maybe. So, so maybe. It so happens. what are you going to buy with my money? What are you going to buy with my wallet, money? So. Probably nothing, because you probably didn't have anything in your wallet in the first place. What is that supposed to mean? Are you trying to say I'm broke? I mean, pretty good possibility. Why? Because you're just not I'm a rich man. 
Because you're just not calling and asking about it, and I haven't been here in two nights. Oh, what you been up to? You okay. going to night well, school? No. No? You no, studying to be a stuff. Wall Street banker on the side? What's your side hustle? I'm an accountant. Really? Yeah. Actors. What are you doing in there shaking your behind if you're an accountant? Who says I'm shaking my behind? There's other positions. I don't know. that. Yeah, I know. There's like That's several I positions. I think I know who I am. Obviously, you don't know who I am. There's this, there's this book that has lots of positions in it. Is that what you mean? Sure. Let's go with that. But you think you, okay. you think you know who I am, but you don't actually know who I am. All I know is that there was a My woman aunt. there that her name was Shannon, and she said I was good looking, started getting close, and then my wallet was gone. Hmm, interesting. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Everything I say is true. Yeah, I, I mean, would I mean, totally capable of lying. Yeah. No, I have this weird, I have this weird, you ever see the movie Liar, Liar with Jim Carrey? Yeah, where his yeah, son wished, yeah, where his son wished he couldn't lie. Mm-hmm. And he started telling the truth. The same thing happened to me, so I can't lie now. It's only lasted thing. 24 hours, though. It's been longer than 24 hours, so. No, it hasn't. How do you know? How do you know how long it's been? See, now, now you're lying to me. Maybe you're lying about what the name was. Because. No, see, I think I think you're skimming. I think you're skimming off the top. That's why you're the accountant there. I think <laughs> you know you've been. No, I'm not the accountant for this place. I'm just an accountant by day. Huh. So what are you security there? Are you a bouncer? No, I mean I could be, but apparently girls aren't supposed to do that. Apparently you know guys kung aren't fu? scared. Of, apparently guys aren't scared of girls. I don't know. They sh- they should be. Yeah, they should. I already go, though. I got a job to do. No, you don't. Stop lying. She might she's got dick to suck. Office, can I help you? Yeah, hi. Is Shannon about, please? Hang on. Shannon. Right. Huh? Hi, Shannon. Uh, I guess you spoke with one of my one of my friends a few moments ago, and he was rather rude, and I felt bad the way he treated you, so I thought I would call to apologize on his behalf. Okay, not necessary. I mean, guys are guys, right? Well, he was being he was being a dick, and I'm I've been trying to teach him how to riz properly, and he's just not taking it to heart. He's he's really being a slacker. So are you guys going to come in, or are you just going to waste my time on the phone? Uh, well, I don't want to waste your time because I know you are trying to coach the whores. Um, but on, on a nightly basis, which which of your girls is the best learned in whore? We don't have whores here. We have okay, girls who well, dance. What, what, uh, we don't have whores. We have oh, girls well, who dance. Okay. There's a difference. Well, I mean, we're t- just talking. We're just talking semantics now. So how long have yeah, you been coaching the horse? we're talking actual horse? linguistics. Linguistics of what? Whore literally means someone who actually fucks. We have dancers. We don't have whores. You're in the wrong state no, no. for a horse. A whore, a, a whore in my book is somebody who shakes their boobies to music for money. I like a, I called that. Oh, There's a red dog. Hello? Hi. Is there a oh, red doggy red there? Dog. I was oh. told this was the best red rocket place in the whole wide world. I'll oh, call yeah, my brother on. Like staring at. Hey, hey, how you doing? Um, we're looking good, to come to play some red rock. We're good. Uh, we're coming to play some red rocket with the with the ladies. How big is your biggest lady? Oh, uh, she's pretty big. Well, I, I don't want obese. Like, I'm not discriminatory either. I'm, I'm progressive, so let's just put that huh? out there right now. 
but but I'm I'm looking for an attractive woman, one that's worth the dozens of dollars that I'm coming in there to spend. Oh, okay. Well, they're all here, brother. You just have to come in and take your pick well, at them. Well, is there a picture? Is there a portfolio online where I can go and like a buffet? I can just go in through. I pick it like a menu. I'm like, hey, I want it, the yeah. We we do have a we do have a Facebook yes yeah, that you can look at, and we got a couple of the girls on there. Okay, are the, are those the most popular girls, or are those the ones you're trying to get rid of on a clearance sale? <laughs> well, we just got them on there because they're you know they're uh, what the customers want. Do they suck it? I don't know. Do, do they? Stuck down some food because they're some they're pretty big. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Big ones. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Little seedlings that are. Hello. Hello. Hi, I got a seedling Hello. in my pants. Hello. Hello. Hi, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. All right, I got seeds. I was wondering yeah. if I could plant them there. No, wrong place. Well, this is a cons- Seeds in your hole. Hello. Growing out of our skin. Hey, listen, pal. We're over here at the growing hole, and we need our shit, and you're trying to block us, and we don't oh, Okay, well, go fuck yourself. <laughs> no, what am I going to Go fuck me. yourself. Your, your, expectation, your expectations oh, of fuck what your mother. are very, very low. Fuck your mother. Oh, you're a dumbass. You have a vengeance. <laughs> Fancies, this is Heather. How may I help you? Hey, Fancies. How's it going? Oh, my uh, God. It's fine. All right. Uh, can you turn that jungle music down while I talk? Okay. I can't turn anything down because that's over there in another part of the building. What can I do for you, baby? Okay. Go over there and t- go, go turn it down, Fatsies. Okay. What what can I do for you, sweetheart? You can turn I'm the music musician. down. I'm a musician. I'm a musician. Okay. Okay. Yeah, and I was wondering if I could come in there and audition to play audition while the girls for, are dancing. Audition for what? To play music while the girls are dancing and shaking. Uh, you know? Well, no, we don't need anybody right now, sweetheart. Thank you. No, but I'll work. I'll work for lap dances though. Well, no, we don't. We don't need nobody. Thank you. Hey, what the? Thank you for calling landing ship. This is Mark. How can I help you? Hey, how you doing there, you Mark bitch? Oh, yeah? Yeah. Mark asshole. Oh, you're real funny. I'm sorry. I'm, so- I'm sorry. Your parents named you that, though. I don't know why you're mad at me. Your parents knew what you were going to endure, and they named you that anyway. So I guess your parents must be ashamed of you because how you're talking, bro. I mean, you're making my prank calls. Real, you my sound, parents are. You sound my, like my an older guy, and that must be must be a couple of freaking uh, incest bitches. I'm, yeah. I'm for- What's that, motherfucker? Mm, your mouth. Excuse me. Your mouth. Y'all are the one who's been calling my phone. No, y'all just called my phone and started cussing me out. I am the place of business. What are you talking about, bitch? I just want to yeah, know. Yeah, some, some doofus ass just called me, called me a bitch and everything. Won't you tell who you really are? I am. My name's Mark. I'm the door guy and security. You're welcome to come up here and find out. Why are y'all, why are you call me for, and how'd you get my phone number? Well, one, you called me, and I returned your phone call because you wanted to call and prank me. <laughs> so... So just well, let y'all know, just let, you, just let you know, I'll be turning this this number over to the police department, and they'll take care of it from here. What? Have a good evening. I mean, what? Point on. Hi, honey baby. Who is this? My name is Jack. I'm looking for a girlfriend. Who is this? I'm Jack. I come in there every Sunday. Oh, well, I don't church. work Sundays. Oh. And you definitely don't come in here That's after okay. church. It's not even open until 6. Who is this? Well, it's Jack, silly. <laughs> You're a liar. Who is this? No, I'm not a liar. I like oh, yeah? girls. 
I don't then like show boys. your face. Show your face then. No, but I'm ugly. Okay. Well, I like ugly. Show your face. No, you say that now, but if you really saw me, you'd run away in fear. Hey, it's the girl with the apple. Who the fuck is this? <laughs> <laughs> Who is this? I gotta make drinks, yo. Who is this? What what kind of drink? <laughs> Liquor drink. Hawaiian oh, Don. Uh, can I have a kitty cock? Can I have a kitty cocktail? <laughs> is that like a Cape Cod? It's uh what is the kitty cocktail? It's it's grenadine, isn't it? Grenadine. <laughs> I gotta go. I I gotta I make know. drinks. I gotta go. <laughs> All right, go shake it. What? Go like, shake it. Get in here and I'll and I'll and I'll make you whatever you want, okay? Shake oh. it, don't break it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Later. <laughs> See if they can remove the paint. Hello. Cover me, hippo. This is Molly. How can I help you? Hi, Molly. Have you got the paint thinner down there? The what? The paint thinner. The girls that strip the paint? No, sir. We sure don't. Oh, they strip the clothes? We're only topless, but we have to wear pasties, baby. Oh, that's lame. Let me put my brother on. He can talk some sense into your boss. Hi, uh, is this Molly not... Is this... Are, is this are, did you say you got the hippos there? This is the peppermint hippo. Oh, okay. Well... How big how big you girl you gotta be to work there? Uh, do you can be any size, sweetheart. We do not discriminate. Okay, all right, all right. Um who's who's your fattest girl in there tonight? Uh that's that's a rude question. So no, I'm gonna big, let you go there? because th- no, that's it, very hey, rude. Is big, is big Belly Amy there? I don't even know who you're talking about. So have a good night, sweetheart. Is is pregnant Tiffany there? Fresh quarter. Hello. Hello. How y'all doing? Good. How are you? Uh, My name is Dr. Nauzardin. Okay. How are you doing with that? Yeah, I... I like the ladies that have a problem with their eating habits. Too small. Centerfold. Centerfold. Hello. Hello. Centerfold. How y'all doing? Good. How are you? Hey, do you? Uh, my name is uh, Dr. Nauzar. Do you have the lady? You know, the big lady. Who? I do the weight loss surgery, but I like to watch the big lady. Uh, don't call back, you fool. I'll call the police with your number. Centerfold. Hello. Centerfold. Hi. Centerfold. What Are do you, you mean? having a problem hearing me? No. Hi, I'm doing a book report. I'm doing a, a, a report for school. I can't help you. I can't help you. Sorry. Why? The poles. Science club. Hi. Did you do the stripping of the poles there? Let me put my brother on. I'm sorry. Hello. Excuse me. Hello. Hi, science club. How can I help you? (laughs) Yeah. uh, What does it mean when the lady offers me a sushi roll? I'm not sure. She told me if I went in the back and gave her an extra 10 bucks, she'd give me a sushi roll. I don't know what that means. Uh, can't tell you, man. <laughs> Have you ever got a sushi roll before? Not in a strip club. <laughs> Where do you usually get yours at? Uh, Fuji's. Some Japanese place or something. Is it a is it a all like a like a buffet or do you just pay and get a couple of pieces? I just get a couple of pieces usually. Okay, well you're starting to piss me off. I'm gonna put my wife on. 
Clementine? <laughs> Hello. Hello. Who? Hello. Hello. Hi, how's it going? Hello? Hello? Oh, it's all right. How are you? Doing good. How are you? Nice. Pretty good. How are you? I'm great. How are you? Pretty excellent, actually. Sounds I'm fucking good. her right now. So it's really good. Hey, you want to talk to him? How about you? What? That's prank talk. We're fucking. Huh? So just prank talk. Oh. Uh, nah, I got better things to do than talk to him. It's not a call, Tom. Thanks, Paul. There you go. Okay. Hello? 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 Remember the plus pack? Oh. <laughs> yeah, I had that. Thank you for calling me around Dallas. How can I help you tonight? Hey, man. How you Perfect. doing? Doing good. How are you? I was pretty good. Well, I, well I'm doing pretty good. Uh, I just what can I help you with? Uh, do, do the ladies allow me to bring in some mustard? Nope, can't have any outside food or uh, beverages. Well, it's not really a food. It's more of a lubricant. We can't and have that come inside. There I mean, we go, I but yeah, we can't have that come inside. In. There you go. Are there any mustard ladies there? Not that I know of. Could you put one on the phone, see if I could talk to him about having some mustard time? Sure, let me double check. All right, thank you. I appreciate it. Hey, guys, how can I help you? Hey, ma'am, I was just wondering, uh... Oh, what? my God, too loud. Wow. Yeah. Vegas Club, how can I help you? Vegas Club, how can I help you? What? Hello? Sorry, Vegas Club, how can I help you? It slipped out of my hand. Hello? Hello? Hey, man, go ahead. Yeah. Uh, you can hear me? Uh, I, yes, I can, barely, but I can hear you. Oh, well, I, I, I dropped my phone a little bit. It might have been a little fucked up. Uh, how you doing tonight, brother? Uh, good, good. That's good, brother. Well, what I want to know is what the cover charge is, first of all. The cover charge is going to be 15. 16? 1, 5, 15. One five. All right, all right. How how many ladies dance to the mustard out there? Uh, tonight or just on average? Well, I'd say on average, but I'd prefer tonight. I'm trying to come up there tonight. Yeah, I man, it's usually about twenty. Twenty? Twenty dance to the mustard? You said how many dancers we have per night? No, no, I said, how many dancers dance to the mustard? I uh, don't understand what you're trying to ask, man. Well, you know, like the mustard, like the sauce that you put on the hot dog? Yeah, no, don't know. <laughs> but yeah, cover charge $50. What do you mean, man? I don't know? Well, what the hell do you do there? You just answer your phone and tell people what the cover charge is? Uh, I'm actually the, the security man, so I'm just trying to see what you need. Oh. How many how many bags of cocaine have you confiscated tonight? Hmm. Oh, this is early. Trying to end it soon. No, no, I'm not trying to end it. I go till one. Hi, I go till one o'clock. How long do you go? Thank you for calling Rex Cabaret. How can I help you? Hello? Hello? 
Hello? Hi, how can I help you? Sorry, my phone's a little bit fucked up. I done dropped it in the toilet a little bit earlier, but I think I rinsed it out. No, it's all right. Um, I just wonder what the cover charge is there. It's $20 per person. What if I bring a lady? It's still $20 per person. Well, she's a lady of the night, though. What do you mean, sir? Well, I mean, she's a lady of the night. What do you mean what I mean? It's still 20 per person. Yeah, but she's an important lady. She's the lady of the night. I'm important, too, and I still have to pay $20, babe. I don't know how important you are. I mean, you're working the phones at the strip club. Are you that important? Hello? Hey there. Hey. Hey, this is Dr. Gilmore. Uh, I, I've been around a few places. I've uh, been trying to come down there. Um, you guys dancing? Dance? I think she hung up the phone, or tried to, son. Is that what they call an l Riz? Yeah, I just want to take my son to the strip club. The hell? The men's club, Dallas, how can I help you? Hey, how y'all doing? Y'all hey, dancing this evening? I'm sorry? Will there be dancing? It's like one antenna Hello. disrupt Hello? submarine communication. Hello? Hi. Uh, listen, are you there? Can you hear me? Yes. Oh, I, I'm sorry to just bother you so late, but um, I felt that I was... I had a moral imperative to tell you this. You see, I was walking home from work, and I had to, uh, well, I there's no easy way to say this. I had some really bad diarrhea, and I actually went in your yard, and I felt that I needed to tell you of this before you stepped out into it. Where, in where, do you, where are you at? Well, I'm down the street right now. I just went into your bath, into your yard right now. Like, I defecated in your yard. Over at the highway? No, near your right in front of your house. Well, you must not be in front of my house. Why is that? Where you at? Uh, oh God, I'm. I was at just at your house, and I took a dump right there in your front. Oh, it was really bad. I had some of that Wendy's chili. Ah. Uh, it really tore up my stomach. I hope Who you don't mind. This? Oh, this is Jake. I'm I'm sorry. May I ask who I'm talking to? Yeah. Who are you talking to? Who am I talking to? How far are you in town or on your way to town? Or? Yeah, I, I am on my way to town. I was actually doing a job up there. But uh, up near your house, but... Uh, God, I had some chili for lunch, and it just went right through me. And I had I to stop right in front of, of your. You oh, I do construction work, but that's not the issue. The issue is, is that I just went to the bathroom, like on your front porch there, and it's like everywhere. My front porch. Well, yeah. Where else What's would I go? What's wrong with the yard? Well. I figure it would be easier to clean up if it was in your front porch. You better, well, you better well, be it's right there on your front you. porch. It's diarrhea. It's like a listen, ma'am. It's like a bucket of diarrhea right all over your porch, and it, it's pretty bad. You, you better I just be wanted glad. to call you up and you be better not, be glad I didn't hear you. If you had, you'd have got shot. Yeah, well, I'm trying to be nice to you, ma'am. You could at least say thank you for for me telling you all this. Would you rather just wake up and find it on your porch smeared everywhere? Well, I guess I would, but do you live here in you live here in Mountain City? 
Well, I don't know. I don't want to tell you now since you're acting like this. But here's the thing. Uh-huh. I think you had like a, uh, I think you had something on your porch, like maybe like a cloth or a cushion or something. I can't, I don't really remember because it was, I was shitting my brains out, but I grabbed it and I wiped my ass with it. So I hope you don't mind. What were you driving? I was walking. A walking? Yes. There was other places closer was, uh, than mine. I'm sorry, what? There was other houses Listen, closer ma'am. than mine. Well, well, you know what? I just figured I'm going to tell you. That's all I really wanted to do. So I hope you don't mind. <laughs> well, yes, I mind, but there ain't nothing I can do about it. Just the next time, <laughs> you better stop somewhere else because if you make a noise, I'll shoot you. So just I don't want to kill nobody. Okay? You'd shoot me just for taking a I dump on your yard? Loaded. Really? So do you shoot a lot of people that come around there? Hello? Hello? Hi yes, yes, this is your bumble. Hello. How are you? Who is this? This is your mumble. Hello. Uh, I uh, sorry to disturb you. I, I I need your help this evening. The uh, trash can has fallen over. Okay. Thank you. Oh uh, yes, sir. The the, the trash that you want me to. I'm out of place on my turn. How can I help you? Hi. I've been walking around outside here, but I had a little accident. I'm not a guest here. Uh, I ac- I accidentally had to, I turned around because I was walking around and I had to make doo-doo, caca, feces out of my out of my bottom. I turned around and it sprayed out from my, my anus all over the front door of one of these hotel rooms here. I just wanted to let you know that I made a doo-doo, caca, feces uh, mess on the door. Is there something you want me to do? Like, should I clean it up? Do you have any cleaning supplies? No, that's okay. Oh, God. Do you have any toilet paper? I couldn't get to the toilet in time. Hello? Hello? Hi, do you have any, any cleaning supply? I can't get to the toilet. Okay, so uh, where are you? Uh, I was out, I was over here in the rooms, in the hallway here, the walkway. Okay, so which hallway, which walkway? Yeah, the, the one by the parking lot. I turned around and got all turned around. I couldn't find a toilet. Yeah, out but came. every... Every hallway, it's near the parking lot. Like, we are surrounded by a parking lot. So which hallway are you currently well, the at? One, yeah, the one near the office there. I'm not currently there. I'm just letting you know this happened about five minutes ago. I turned around. got turned around. I couldn't find my room. Okay. And which is your room number? Well, I don't have it. My wife has it. That's why I couldn't find it. Because she told me one number, but none of the numbers matched up. She said 215, but I... I couldn't find it. Okay. No worries. We'll go ahead and send someone, okay? All right. But you got toilet paper? Yes. All right. I need some of that. You got okay. the plunger? You do realize that what you're telling me doesn't make sense, right? Well, I'm, uh, once I you find the room... Me, you just told I'm me you're in the hallway. Now you're asking me for something. If you really don't have anything else to do, I suggest you to get a job. I'm telling you, I'm when I get into the room, I'm going to have a wonderful problem. evening. Dad. Uh, hello? Hello? Yes, hello. Is your one-stop shop How are you? All things ask for late. Ask for stuff. Hello? Yes. Yes, I need your assistance. Huh? I need your assistance. I'm on my 
Who is the assistant? Please, please. I, I, I am asking. I need your help. I have to. Wow. Hello? Hi. Hello, Motel. Chris speaking. How may I help you? Hi, Christ. How are you? God bless you. God bless me. God bless the world. Good. How are you? Um, I'm fine, except for the the, an, the animal rituals that we've been doing in the room, and now there's a mess. Okay. We've been baptizing cats and dogs in our room. We're making them into warriors of God. Hey. Take my input. Yeah. Thanks for calling Days and Sweets. How can I help you? Hello. 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 Hi. How are you doing tonight, honey baby? How's it going? Can I get you to... Well, I'm looking... Well, I can't sign through the phone. How do you want me to sign it? I'm talking with the guest. How can I help you? Oh, all right. Yeah, I'm looking for vacancies. Yeah, you looking for one bed or two beds? Two beds, and what is your purpose? What is my purpose for... Yeah. Being an asshole. All right, I'm going to go ahead and release the call if this is how it's going to go. What is your purpose? Go book online if you want. Release it. Uh, I think he only has a function. All right. Thank you. No, 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 hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Travel Laws West. Hello? Travel Laws West. How you doing in that there, brother? All good. How are you, sir? Uh, not too bad. I mean, I got a room here with y'all, and uh, I got a little bit of a problem. And I, I'm a little embarrassed. I don't want to tell you about it, but... Uh, I got number? two, I guess. Four two seven. Sorry. Four two seven. Uh, what's your room number? Two seven two. We don't have that number, sir. No, I said two one two. Two one two. Yeah. Yeah. What's the issue? Well, uh, man, I'm so embarrassed. I don't, I don't, I don't really want to tell you, but we had a mustard party up here, right? Sorry. And uh, I try. We had a mustard party up here. I think you're calling the wrong property, sir. Why do you think that? I think you are calling the wrong property. Well, why do you think that? Sorry? What do you mean? Sitting with that mustard. Why, why, do you think, why do you think I'm calling the wrong property? Uh, because there's nobody in 212, actually. Well, I climbed up. I got a ladder, and I climbed up on the balcony and through the window. I'm sorry? I got a ladder. I got, uh, I got a 20-foot ladder, and I climbed up then through the window. Yeah, we just climbed up in here. Yeah, I didn't say that I actually, like, procured the room. I procured it on my own, you know? So, yeah, what's the issue then? Well, I we climbed up the ladder, all of us, all ten of us, climbed up the ladder, and we, had a, we were starting to have a mustard party. And then, as people were climbing down, the mu- the mustard got on the ladder, and it got a little slick, and then the ladder fell over. So, could you go out in the parking lot and put the ladder back up so we could get out of this bitch? 
Sorry, sir. Because the door is locked, like, the inside. Like, we can't get sorry, out of the sorry, room. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Bye. What do you mean, sorry, sir? What do you mean? So, I think you're calling the wrong property. No, I'm up in that room. Uh, what's the property name? Bing Bong Ching Chong or something like that. I don't know, dude. We just rolled up. I had the ladder on the top of my van. Jason. Hi. Is this uh, is this hours out? Can I get hours there? I don't understand your question. Well, it's days in, but I'm hours out. Like, how, how many vacancies you got? Um, like, will you got, have them when I'm there? Uh, we got, yeah, someone's going to be here. Um, Someone's always here. You got 13 left? Okay. So, I, I've yeah. got my whole family here in the station wagon, SUV. Here, let me put let me put this all on speakerphone here. Push the button here. Are you going to need um, two rooms? We're going to need more than two. Are you yeah, need two I don't think you should drink while you're driving. There's 12 of us. You got enough room for 12? Oh, probably not. Your breath smells funny, Dad. Okay, I well, want my own bathroom. I'm to change my diaper. Mom, mm-hmm. can I get water instead of beer? I'm tired of I'm tired of the Bud Light. <laughs> Subs wear, uh, like, Brand new. pants models. Uh, be 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 Grandview. Hello? Hello? Grandview? Hey, yep. I'm up in this room here, and I, 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 my dad doesn't drink a bunch too much Bud Light, and he put the microwave in the sink. Where are you at? Well, Hello? I'm up here in the room. What room? Well, I don't know if I want to tell you what room. I'm a little scared now. My dad put the microwave in the in the dishwasher. You, you got the wrong, you, I don't know who you're calling, but there, there's no dishwashers in these rooms. Well, I mean by dishwasher, I mean the sink. And also my mom. And by sink, he means you're a fucking asshole. Hi, I'm the dad. Uh, that's my dad. Don't Sorry, work he's a little, work. he been been drinking a little bit. We got the double room, you know. Mom and him are sleeping in one bed and I'm sleeping what, in the what other. What room are you in? together. What room you, are you in? Don't, don't you don't you tell this I, motherfucker. I can't I can't tell you. Dad said he's gonna hit me with the microwave if I tell you. Oh bullshit. What the fuck? I know it is bullshit. I don't I wanna tell you but I can't because daddy said Well no. I think you got the wrong fucking number. I ain't asking well, I, to my kid that way, motherfucker you. Yeah, you don't talk to me that way. My daddy gonna come down there and, and whoop you. Yeah, I'll teach my oh, son bullshit. how to fuck a man right. I'll make it. I'll make him watch me fuck he's, you. He's got two fists for two. No mud hole. He's got two fists for two lips. You damn right. You take it. Let me be your inbred smoke. Hello, Jim Hi. Uh, can you send the woman up uh, so my son can lose his virginity, please? A what? Well, my son's here with me, and uh, he's ready to lose his virginity. Can you send the woman up? This is a motel. Yeah, send send your uh, your in-house hooker to our room so my son could lose his virginity. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know. I will send one for you. Mm, okay, please. is it you? Is, is it huh? you? Is it you? What? Is it you? No. Uh, Dad, have her come up. Have her come up. Okay, Papa. come come up. Come up to the room so my son can fuck you. Mm, I need it for my first time. I've been so horny for so long. Yeah, he he needs to practice on foreign women before he goes for American. He's got three inches of fury. <laughs> Hello. You didn't say long. Or... Hi, is this the madam of the hotel? I don't need to talk to you, okay? Just leave us alone. Bye. My son, no, my son's ready to lose it. He's ready to lose it. He's ready. Hello? 
So that's when I tucked it inside of her, right? And I was like, yeah. Can you just meet, leave me alone? No, you keep answering the phone. What am I supposed to do here, lady? We need to ask her. I have a client with me right now. Thank you. Uh, uh, well, I, I really can't hold. Damn it. Hmm, this is a banger. What if we call some oh, hotel in the Northeast? To go on hold. Hello? Yes? Oh, I'm oh. sorry, hello. Oh, yeah. I got my brother on the back line here. Oh yeah. Uh, we 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 had a little incident. We were staying there. Mhm. And uh, I didn't know what to do about it. Okay. What was the incident? Well, my brother was trying to do a mustard enema on me uh, to cleanse me out, um, so we'd be prepared for you know you you know what it's Pride Month, right? Okay. And. Well, I had a little bit of gaseous explosion out 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 the rear end, and it painted the walls. I'm just gonna be honest with you; it painted the walls. Okay. Did you? Do have you a all have number? anything to? Well, I'm a little embarrassed. I mean, about telling you what the room number is. I think we can clean it all off, but I just don't want to know if you got some cleaning materials. I could. I can meet your maintenance person down by the elevator, if that's all right. Uh, we would just have to bring it up to the room for you. Well, why do you got to bring it up to the room? I mean, I could just meet you downstairs and grab it's a couple just, bottles of... We're not able to give it to the guests. We would just have to bring it up. Well, I mean, if you're going to bring it up, then you're going to give it to me, right? No, they would just clean it up. Well, I mean, I, I don't want them to be disturbed by what happened. So I'd rather clean it up myself, but I I need some supplies. We're not able to. I'm sorry. It's just policy. Well, I mean, how how much does policy uh, determine on monetary wise? You know what I'm saying? That's just what it is. Unfortunately, I'm sorry about that. Well, what, what if I came down there on the front desk and slipped you a little bit of a dollar bill or three? I got I got a we'll fat stack of two dollar bills. Excuse me, don't cut me off. I'm I'm still speaking. What I have a fat stack of two dollar bills. Okay, I understand. We would still have to send it up to the room. Well, I don't really don't appreciate all that typing you're doing while you're trying to talk to me. I I think you need to focus on what's going on here. I'm completely aware of what you're saying, sir. Uh, it really doesn't feel like it. I really don't think you're aware of what's going on in this situation. We have mustard sprayed all over the walls, and I want to clean it up so you don't charge me for it. Now, if we right. bring maintenance up here and they have to clean it off the walls, then you're going to charge me for it. So I just want a little bit of Clorox bleach wipes and such to wipe it off the walls. Clean it up. Gotcha, sir. Um, just need the room number. Well, you keep typing there, and uh, that pause really determines that you're not paying attention to what I'm saying. Okay, so, sorry. Did you have the room number, sir? Ma'am, you keep typing and ignoring what I'm saying. I have stopped typing. Did you have a room number? I can still hear you typing in the background. I right, stopped typing. What are you listening to music-wise? There's like some weird music in the background then, I guess. It sounds like that. I'm not sure. I'm not hearing what you're hearing. Well, I mean, it's only you and I on the phone, so it's got to be you playing the music. I ain't playing no music. I'm not sure. Did you have a room number, sir? Ma'am, I really don't appreciate the altitude you're giving me right now. Okay, just trying to assist you. I mean, is there a man that you can put on the phone? Yeah, absolutely. All right, put the man on the phone. I appreciate that. You're welcome. Yeah. Aloha from the Royal Sinesta. This is Tamara. Hello. LA? Hi there. How may I help you? 
Uh, how are you doing tonight, lady? I am doing good. <laughs> well, that's pretty dang good. I appreciate you telling me how you're doing. That's pretty nice. <laughs> Asshole. Well, anyway, so I was staying here on the honeymoon with my boyfriend, and we got a little bit of a problem. It's what? It's what? It's all over the goddamn floor, I'll tell you that right now. Yeah, that's my man right there in the background. We just, we're newlyweds. We just got hitched. Okay, wait, but you're cutting yep. in and out, so I'm sorry, What what is, what's going on? Well, it's all over the floor. All over the goddamn floor. What's on the floor? Well, so... She doesn't understand, she doesn't understand. It's all over the goddamn floor. Tell her, tell her, honey, goddamn. Yeah, it it is all over the goddamn floor, so we, we... We have this special mustard that we brought with us, mm-hmm. and we had it in our carry-on and stuff, and it was all good. It was, you know, fine. Okay, wait, what is and the we room number it up. first? <laughs> well, I mean, I don't think the room number really matters on this, because I'm just asking. I'm, just let me finish, well, I okay? I can't help you with your mustard. Oh, okay, go ahead. Well, <laughs> if you let me finish, then you can, because um, I'll meet you down in the lobby for the the cleaning equipment that we're going to need. So what happened is we brought uh, this uh, bottle of mustard. It's special from our, our culture. We brought it to us to have with us, and we like to have a little bit of mustard party, you know? We like to squirt it on each other and lick it off. Yeah, that's funny. Goddamn right. You know, that kind of thing. Sinesta Hotel well, and Resort. One... <laughs> She's not believing you. Mustard. Hello? I got disconnected or transferred or something. Hello? Yes, sir. Can I help you? This is... Hello? Hello? It's all over the goddamn floor. It's all over the goddamn floor. I was talking to this lady and it just now got transferred to you all all of a sudden. What the hell is going on? over the goddamn floor. Yes, this is a security Orlando. Can I help you, sir? Security? Hey. Yes, okay. correct. Well, I mean, so me and my lover were here on, on our vacation of yeah, uh, newlyweds, you know? We, are, we came out are here you to, staying to here? Visit. Uh, yes, sir. Duh. Duh. Are I mean, I don't mean here? to you excuse gender. Wait, what's your pronouns? Yeah, my name is Rolando. I'm a security dispatch at Rail Sinesta Resort. Can I help you? Rolando. Uh, well, Ronaldo, 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 what's your pronouns? Are you yes, he? He is she? Are you a baby? Hang on, baby. Hang on, baby. Ronaldo, what's your pronouns? What pronouns, sir? This is Royal Sinesta Security. Do you need anything? I do, I do. I had the mustard party in my room with my fiance right here. That's correct. What is your room number? Well, what I don't want to talk number? about it. I just, I just need some cleaning supplies. That's correct. How can I send the cleaning supplies to your room if you don't tell me the room number? Well, I'm going to meet you at the bottom of the elevator and grab the cleaning supplies. Which elevator? Well, the number one, obviously. That's one I'm nearby. We have number one elevator, but it belongs to that Duke's restaurant. Yeah, but I mean, well, I mean, like the number one of the hotel. I don't. I mean, I don't know the one that I took up. Sir, uh, we just make clear because every call that we have is important. Just give me your ma'am. number and give me ma'am. what you need, ma'am. and I'm gonna ma'am. send ma'am. you. What... Ma'am, 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 calm down, calm down. I don't need nobody coming up to my room. I don't need... The fucking message to make mention of it. Hello. Hawaiian Nature's Park, this is Joe speaking. Hi, Joe. You you yes. have uh, openings? Oh, for tonight? Yeah. Uh, the only cabin I have left is our bunkhouse cabin, which you get the whole cabin to yourself, but um, the bed is configured as a full-size bunk. Okay, do you have party holes? I'm sorry, what? 
The party hole. A party hole? I'm not familiar. Well, usually when we come down there, there's usually a hole in the door. And usually people come by and they drop like candy through the hole and, and they shout, hey, it's the party hole, party hole. Mm. But usually there's a lot of grease and juice. Yeah. You sound you sound a bit yeah. old to be making these kind of phone calls. I don't get it. Well, I'm an adult I mean, and I'm trying to make a booking, so. Well, you yeah. Sound, yeah, you sound like you. Let me put my I dad the, on. How about that? Okay. You're right. being weird, man. Yeah. Go find Jesus. Hey. I'm gonna cry. Why Nature's Park? This is Joe. Hello. Yes, hello. So this is Nature's Park. Yes, it is. Well, how you doing out there, brother? I'm pretty good. Hell yeah. You not going to ask how I'm doing, or are you just going to be rude like that? Right. So here's something that you should know, okay? So you think that sure. I am just running a small hotel here, but I actually used to be a computer forensic detective and work for the Everett Police Department oh, in Washington shit. State. Oh, yeah, shit. It's, it's your lucky day. You're so if you're, using, if you're using voice over IP or some other kind of way to anonymize your phone number, I can definitely still trace no. your IP address. So no, I'm using suggest you back I'm off before you turn this into a criminal investigation. Understand? I'm using you have a good Skype. night. Hi, Nature's Park. This is Joe. Hey, Joe. How hey, how can I help tonight? you? Pretty well. Well, I was just wondering, uh, I smoked all of your MD5 hash. I literally smoked You You really do want to turn this into a criminal telephone harassment case, don't you? You actually want to turn criminal it into a... Criminal telephone Hey, you want to turn this into a homosexual case? Uh, we're about okay. to turn it into a super hex. <laughs> okay, why don't you stay on the line with me a little bit longer here? Yeah. Sorry, let, let's, we'll let's wait up. while he activates his his Radio Shack clearance tracer. Hey, watch how he's going to catch the kids in now. Dun, dun, dun. Beep, boop, beep, ah. Come on, man, I thought you smoked all that. Well, I smoked it all. I'll tell you that right now. How does he have it still then? Hey man, I got I got two fists for two lips. How do you go from computer forensics expert to hotel front desk clerk? Yeah, I'd like to hear that too. Okay, I'll tell you what, guys, if you don't believe me, Google search my name. My name is Joe. All right, what's your name? Blubber Shack. Hello, hello. Hi, that's my dick. Hello? That's my dick. That's my oh, dick. Yeah? That's my dick. Get your hand out of there. Get your hand out of there now. Yo, get your hand out. Yo, dude. Hello? Uh, what the Hello? fuck? Yeah, some dude was attacking me. You're still open? Yo, that's a nice dick. Are you having a Tourette's moment? He left his dick hanging out of shirt collar. Yeah, oh, come on out. Can I come talk on out the if you, time, you want to have some problems. So. You come on out. Oh, yeah. I want some you problems. You got a big problem. You left what your dick hanging fuck? out your shirt collar. I there. wish I could put Jeez. this on speaker. I swear this guy got Tourette's or something. What's up, boy? No, off that phone. Let me Yeah, okay. You come on out. You got a problem. You come on out. Who are you talking to? Joanne Lounge. <laughs> Well, t- t- is Joanne there? Is Joanne um, there? Yes, Matt is speaking. Uh, yeah, my name is Dwight. She'll know what it's about. Okay, give me one moment. I right, heard the fuck up. Hi, Hello? how you doing, Joanne? Hi. Okay. Hi. I'm calling about I'm calling about your it's Dwight, the criminal. I sent you an email. 
Oh, you did? What? What? What you mean? Yeah, I'm. I'm in jail. I'm in jail. I'm in jail right now. And uh, I, yes, I'll accept your proposal when I get out. Me and you will will be husband and wife. I accept. Yes, thank you. Awfully huh? nice of you to ask me. Yeah. Well, well what's no, going I, on? Well, what? Who are you? I'm Dwight. I'm the guy you've been writing to in jail. And you just you asked me to no, marry you when me. I get out in two weeks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not me though. Yeah, no. They they said they're releasing me to your custody, and you asked me to get married, and I say yes. No, not me. You got the wrong number. Yeah, yeah. No, no. me and you are going to be husband, husband and wife. We're going to share all of our stuff. I've been married for over twenty years. What you talking about? No, we're going to all you your, your stuff will be mine. Person. All my stuff will be yours. No, no. Listen, listen. No, 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 me because you, you are wrong. I, I don't know who the hell you no, are, I tr- and I don't know what you're talking about. You get the wrong number. I treat you person. right. No, I treat you right. I treat you right. Dog the Bounty Hunter locked me up, and I'm back. I'm back. <laughs> Aloha, thank you for calling the Fairmont Orchid. This is Alpha. How may I direct your call? Hi. Is it, is, is it the same as a super plant, the plant thing? The, or- Sorry, the orchid, the, the organ. Orchid. Yeah, the or- orchid, the orchid man. I need him to come to my room. I have bugs. What's your room number? Two fifteen. I'm the man with the with the humongous gut. Humongous. Oral oral service. Aloha, thank you for calling the Fairmont Orchid. How may I direct your call? Hi, hi. We got we got disconnected. Oh, okay. What was your room number? Uh, two fifteen. Yeah, hi. We don't have a two fifteen. Well, not anymore. Not ever since it burnt down. <laughs> down to the head. Laboratory. This is Nani. How can he help you? Hey, hey, hey! Hello? How you doing there, baby? How you doing, baby? Hello. Hello, stupid. Are you are you there, stupid? Hello? Me ma'am? Good evening, Kuhio Grill, downtown Hilo. But but where downtown? Uh eighty Powahi Street. Across the county building. Okay. And then when I come down there, what happens then? Uh, you can come in and dine in. We do close at 730. Okay. But I want to I wanna eat the shell. Uh, we don't have anything that has a shell. Uh, if you go online and look at you, our website, you can see what we offer on our menu. You don't have peanuts? No. You have crab? No. Do you have lobster? No. Do you have a pet turtle? Do you have crabs? No. no. You Do can you take a look at our menu babies? online. We have a lot of local favorites with no crabs. Okay. Do you have scabies? Oh. oh, far, far between. I come to Hawaii and you feed me fucking chicken for you. <laughs> Hello, Burger Joint. Chan is speaking. Hi, do you have those new vegan burgers? The new vegan burgers? No. Just yeah. our old ones. They're made yeah, they're made with human. I really <laughs> like them. All right, thank you. Bye bye. Yeah, I don't want to eat animals, I wanna eat people. Hi, my pancakes were not very fluffy when I was there. How long ago were you here? This I was there back in 1976, and I had the flattest pancakes you'd ever seen. Alrighty, I'll let the cook know. Is the cook still alive? It was a long time ago. No. Well, I'll, I'll let the cooks know that the pancakes, you know, are not that fluffy. We we'll have to make sure they're all every every. What is? There. Yeah, what is the action plan, though? How are we going to remediate this? Excuse me? 
should I come in with a whiteboard and some dry erase markers and we'll strategize how to get the pancakes fluffier? Um, no, we just, we're just, we'll just talk to the cooks and make sure all the pancakes are good when every customer gets theirs. Yeah, but how, though? How do you make them fluffier? You could say that you're going to make them fluffier, but you don't really have a way to plan. One moment. Yeah, one moment. What moment? What moment? <laughs> just what moment? Thank you so how much you for holding. Things? I'm so sorry. How can I help you? Hello? Hi, um, I was just talking to some. Yeah, I was just talking to somebody about the lack of fluffiness in the pancakes. Okay. He said that uh, from now on the pancakes are going to be fluffier. He okay. said from now on the pancakes are going to be fluffier. But he didn't say how, though. He didn't give me, like, a plan of action. Okay. And how you, you order from us? Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. A long time ago, I got some uh, unfluffy pancakes. Uh-huh. So what is he going to do? Is he going to, like, put compressed air in them? Like, how is he going to make them fluffy? I don't know, sir, but I'm sure. When were you here? I'm so sorry. This is like the middle of dining, so I would like to assist you, but how can I help you, sir? You want to come for, well, for um, pancakes? I mean, when were you here? I don't understand the reason of your call. What can I do for you, sir? Well, what do you mean it's the middle of service? Well, we're in dinner right okay. now, and what I want to make it? sure that I give you the correct attention and answer, so I'm not trying to ask you. What is exactly that you are seeking for, sir? I wanted the fluffiest pancakes possible. Okay. All right, sir. Well, we have a way of making pancakes. I don't know really what is exactly how you want them done, but we have the best pancakes in Hilo. You're more than welcome to come and try us. Oh. Now, I don't know really what is exactly fluffy that you want, but you're more than welcome to try our pancakes. Okay? We're open seven days a week, 6 a.m. to 9 p.m. We'll see you then, okay? okay. Thank you for your time, sir. Okay. Appreciate you. I'll bring it up. Thank you. This has been a production of ImmoralHole.com, a subsidiary of ImmoralJuice.com. Thanks for listening.